with our game of the week. We had a little technical difficulties before, but we're back with it. Lincoln Pius the 10th taking on. Against the Thunderbolts, first possession for the Blue Jays, senior running back Ed Knott using his wheels to get around the outside and across the goal line for six. And uh, going into the second quarter, the Blue Jays threatening the red zone once, once again. And they, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. How about another handoff? Moving high step into the end zone. Not had four touchdowns on the night. Pius the 10th did score a touchdown early on, but it was called back to penalties. So close first half. Seward on the attack again. This time through the air. Quarterback Tristan Haas finds senior tight end Hayden Burhop, and it comes down with it. It was all Seward in our game of the week tonight. 35 to 0 the final. Let's check in with our own Jay Coleman, who's with the winners. Thanks, Nate. We are live here at Bulldog Stadium, We're home of the Seward. And, uh, you know, we guys obviously a big win tonight. Uh, we got head coach Jamie Opfer. We got senior running back Ed Knott here with four touchdowns, by the way, a heck of a game. Thank you. Uh, really quickly, coach, talk to me about what went well for you guys tonight. Well, certainly early on we made some mistakes, had some penalties, which we don't like, so we've got a lot to clean up. But the effort, the effort, the effort. Uh, we preach effort and just playing hard each and every snap. If something bad happens, man, we just got to flush it and move on to the next one. I'm proud of the guys for doing that. And, Ed, as I mentioned, four touchdowns. Can you think of a better game you've had before? Oh, gosh, no, I cannot. This is great. Uh, what do you think was flowing so well with you and the offensive line and the quarterback as well? I mean, what, what was working so well for you guys tonight? Uh, we had a couple good plays that we kind of kept going to, and the line just, they went crazy this game. They gave me the holes and I hit them, so, yeah. And I know earlier in the year we talked with you guys in the offseason. Caden mentioned us to us that he wants to win at least one playoff game. Sure. So far, you guys are 3-0. Uh, is there any limits you guys are holding to this team right now? What do you guys think you're capable of doing this year? You know, right now we're not worried about that. We're just worried about our next opponent. We're going out to the bluff next week. Uh, they are a really, really, really good football team. That's all we're concerned with. So going to watch them film Saturday morning, uh, get in the ice bath, <laughs> and try to get healed up from this battle. Okay. And uh, so, Ed, what we have here, your coach actually has, we have a new, this is our very first time doing this, Game Ooh. of the Week gold chain. We're gonna give it to you, oh, coach, man. if you will, do the honors, yeah. please. And not, you are a stud. Hey, love you, brother. <laughs> love you, you congrats, man. Thank you. Breaking, breaking. <laughs> All right, and that'll do it from us guys here at Bulldog Stadium. Congrats on the win, guys. Go ahead and send it back to you. <laughs> All right, thanks so much, Jay. Thanks to Old Chicago for sponsoring our new Game of the 